We're back guys and this next chapter is a powerful one and it's called Owning 100%. So let's get right to it. We are all self-made men and women, but only the successful take credit for it. I was 18 when I was introduced to the idea of personal responsibility at a seminar and the concept completely transformed my life. If you throw out the rest of this book and only practice this one concept, within two to three years, the changes in your life would be so great, your friends and family would have difficulty remembering the old you. In that seminar I attended at 18, the speaker asked, what percentage of shared responsibility do you have in making a relationship work? What do you guys think that is? Let's find out. I was a teenager, so wise in the ways of true love, of course I had all the answers. 50-50, I blurted out. It was so obvious. Both people must be willing to share their responsibility evenly or someone's getting ripped off. 51-49, yelled someone else, arguing that you'd have to be willing to do more than the other person. Aren't relationships built on self-sacrifice and generosity? 80-20, yelled another. The instructor turned to the easel and wrote 100 zero. On the paper in big black letters, you have to be willing to give 100% with zero expectation of receiving anything in return. Oh, so did you guys get the right answer? <laughs> I didn't. All right, so he said, only when you're willing to take 100% responsibility for making the relationship work, will it work. Otherwise, a rela relationship left to chance will always be vulnerable to disaster. Whoa, this wasn't what I was expecting, but I quickly understood how this concept could transform every area of my life. If I always took 100% responsibility for everything I experienced, completely owning all of my choices and all the ways I responded to whatever happened to me, I held the power. Everything was up to me. I was responsible for everything I did, didn't do, or how I responded to what was done to me. I know you think you take responsibility for your life. I've yet to ask anybody who doesn't say, of course I take responsibility for, <laughs> responsibility for my life. But then you look at how most people operate in this world, there's a lot of finger pointing, victimhood, blaming, and expecting someone else or the government to solve their problems. If you've ever blamed traffic for being late or decided you're in a bad mood because of something your kid, spouse, or co-worker did, you're not taking 100% personal responsibility. You arrived late because the printer was busy? Maybe you shouldn't have waited until the last minute. Co-worker messed up the presentation? Shouldn't you have double checked it yourself before delivering it? Not getting along with your unreasonable team? There aren't, they are a countless fantastic books and classes to help you learn how to deal. You alone are responsible for what you do, don't do, or how you respond to what's done to you. This empowering mindset revolutionized my life. Luck, circumstances, or the right situation wasn't what mattered. If it was to be, it was up to me. I was free to fly. No matter who was elected president, how badly the economy tanked, or what anybody said, did, or didn't do, I was still 100% in control of me. Through choosing to be officially liberated from the past, present, and future victimhood, I'd hit the jackpot. I had the ultimate, uh, I had unlimited power to control my destiny. Well, so there you have it, guys. And knowing that you are 100% responsible for every action and every outcome in your life is very liberating or it can be very disturbing. I know for me at first when I found out about this, it was very difficult to accept. But once you do, <laughs> it truly is liberating, guys. And you're, you realize that you're opportunities 
are unlimited for you to achieve and become whatever and whoever you wish to, to be. So if you guys are enjoying this book and receiving value from it, please hit the like button. I would really appreciate that. That would help the algorithm to push this video out to more people that need this information. So once again, guys, peace, love, take care.